Baila Jesús, prendió la moto, va a tirar el centro. Que hace nada, viene para Luca, el segundo palo. ¡Gol! Lo grita el equipo de casa, lo hizo Lucas Ocampos, décimo tercero de la temporada. Señoras y señores, el argentino que se pone la camiseta de brillo, canta el 1 a 0. Finally, after five hours, EA have solved the server issue. And we'll finally be able to play FIFA 21. And I was actually doing the intro for this card in review. And then all of a sudden my game froze. I lost connection to the EA servers. And then we're five hours later. And finally we get to do this intro and try out this incredible Argentinian tank. Lucas Ocampos, one of the better players in the Liga Santander last season, gets himself a rule breaker card. And oh my goodness, what a fantastic card this is. Look at the stats, man. 86 pace, 86 shooting, 88 passing, 85 dribbling, 65 defending, and 76 physical. He can do a little bit of everything. And honestly, he can play striker. He can play cam, center mid, center defensive mid, wherever you want him. Even left back to be, I mean, right back to be honest, if you wanted to. Ocampos can do a little bit of everything. Look at the in-game stats, guys. Most of them, aside from the defending, is in the green. And that is what you love to see today. We are going to be playing him at striker and I'm excited to use him. First, let's talk about the pace of 86, guys. He does get a little bit of an upgrade as I'm pulling up his stats. Yes, he gets a plus four upgrade in pace, so he should feel pretty rapid. He is, normally, he is 82 pace, but I mean, the plus four is definitely going to be helping him out in that striker role. Onto the shooting, he gets a plus three shooting, and honestly, 88 finishing, 87 attack positioning. I should be scoring a lot of goals with this card. Onto the passing, guys. The biggest upgrade, in my opinion, plus 10 on his regular card, 90 short passing, 85 long passing, and 90 vision. This guy is phenomenal. He's gonna be a phenomenal cam, honestly. But I mean, like I said, I'm gonna be playing him a striker, so we're gonna be seeing that he gets a plus three in dribbling as well. He usually comes with 69, 64 balance, and he gets a huge upgrade to 75, 81 agility, beautiful stuff there. 84 composure is the stuff of dreams. He gets a plus two in defending, but that doesn't really matter. We're not there for that. And then he gets a downgrade from 84 to 76, but honestly, I'll take the downgrade because with the hot chemistry style, the strength and aggression will go up. So it's like if I was playing with this normal card. Yes, he does have... 91 stamina on his original card in this one he has 82 so hopefully that is not a problem and at this stage of the game 82 stamina is fantastic on to the player traits flare speed dribbler and outside the foot shot that'll be enough of the intro for lucas ocampo the only thing i don't like about this card is that three star weak foot but aside from that he should play fantastic on the pitch i'm so excited to use them so vamos lucas vamos Chao Felix, Renato Sanchez, Lucas Ocampos, buen pase para Crespo de Fallon, but it doesn't matter, the Argentinians, connecting, beautiful connection, Chao Felix, nice dribbling from the Portuguese man, to Lucas Ocampos, he has four stars, weak foot, oh what a steal, se viene, Oof. first shot for Lucas Ocampos, hey he got the ball back, that is, that is the advantage of having a pretty good defending for an attacking player. Game number one, and this guy has an incredible BPL side saying maximum in from Rashford. Team of the week for Mino, and then Alan, the best CDM in the game, to be honest. That's not named Kante. It's going to be a good test for my team for Ocampos. Llorente, Laporte, vamos. Nice, Llorente. Good pass. Ciao, Felix. Crespo. Ahí right, vamos. First one for Ocampos. Goal de Lucas Ocampos. What a fantastic shot. By the rule breaker Ocampos. First shot of the game. First shot for Folio FC. Equals in first goal for the Argentinian tank. That is what you love to see, man. Beautiful shot right there. You saw that speed? Oh my goodness. And I think it's going to lead to a goal. Thanks to Llorente. Se viene. Marcos. Llorente. Let's go. Ay, Crespo. No. The post. The darn post. The Llorente tackle almost led to a goal by Crespo. Come on. There we go. Ay, Laporte, te amo, Laporte. Look at that. He does feel fast, man. Vamos, Renato. Ciao, Felix. Que gol. 
¡Qué gol! ¡Qué gol de Ocampos! Another team play, that is what you love to see. Beautiful play by Lucas Ocampo. He's pointing to everybody in the crowd. I wasn't trying to do that celebration. I'm just writing out the numbers. And Lucas Ocampo, second goal of the match. No wonder he's worth over 100k. All right, guess. Nice interception, vamos Ocampos. Use that pace. All right, <laughs> he just knocked them down. It doesn't matter. Vamos. Ciao, Felix. Ah, casi. So that concludes game number one for Lucas Ocampos, rule breaker. He gets a 7.7 .7 rating, two goals, zero assists, shots on target, two out of two passes completed, 12 out of 16 in dribbles completed, 10 out of 16. Somebody was knocking on the door, so I was gone for a good five minutes. And this guy scored three goals in this, a matter of like probably five minutes. That was uh, had to take care of something, but it doesn't matter. Lucas Ocampo showed out doing only three highlights this review. Hopefully, in the second game, he can do a little bit better. So, vamos, Lucas Ocampos. Well, you wanted to see if Lucas Ocampos can keep up. Look at this incredible team. I, I, I. Vamos, Llorente. Beautiful. Yao, Felix. Oh, que pase para... Vamos, Lucas. Lucas! He moved the goalkeeper, but he missed. No way. How does he miss that? I cannot believe he missed. I should have just finessed it to the right. I clearly saw he moved that goalkeeper. That is user error, man. Terrible user error. Ay, Lucas Ocampos, what a beautiful move. That is the, ah, uh, see, if he was a four-star, four-star, that's a goal right there. I would have finessed that. I always got to keep in mind that three-star weak foot. Matuidi has the ball. Good job, Crespo. Ocampos, oh, beautiful movement. Vamos, ah, the play was there. Oh, beautiful movement by... Ah, beautiful movement by Ocampo. That was a 45th minute. This is a very tough game, but you can definitely feel that high attack positioning. Beautiful pass to Crespo, but then Kyle Walker, obviously one of the best center backs in the game, stops that shot. What a wall. Que pase. Vamos, Marcos. Lucas Ocampo. Ay, 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 ay. All right, vamos a campos. The dribbling on this card, the pace. Look at that, and he drew a foul. Good stuff. Matuidi. Let's go, Matuidi. Crespo. Nice, nice patient right there. Nice patience. Crespo. Lucas. Let's go, Lucas. Oh my gosh, the dribbling on Lucas. Goal! What a goal by Lucas. Oh, Campos, yes, sir. He has arrived uh, once again. That makes it three goals in this review. Man, on that right foot, this guy is deadly, man. He even moved the goalkeeper. I saw him. I was, I'm just going to blast it. He has really good finishing. And wow, man, this guy can definitely play striker. Oh, que pase, vamos, Campos. Give him the assist, Crespo. Vamos, Crespo. Vamos, Crespo. The body on Crespo. Oh, the post. I can't believe this, man. That was the assist I was asking for from Lucas Ocampos. He moved the goalkeeper and then Crespo hit the post. I think the time for Crespo in LCL Argentina is coming on to an end. Oh, pero se viene Crespo. I mean, Campos. Vamos, Campos. Ay. Oh, que pase, vamos Crespo. Ocampos. Ocampos. He moved the goalkeeper, but it doesn't matter. Ocampos, another goal for the Argentinian tank. And that is what I love to see from Lucas Ocampos. Another goal. We tie the ball game up. And yeah, man, Ocampos is carrying the team. He's like, I am the Argentinian Crespo. I'm the Argentinian. Sell, please. Sell Crespo. Vamos, Llorente. Buen pase. 
Lucas Ocampos. Skill moves. Skill move City. Beautiful dribbling right there. Oh. Ocampos! Ooh, it's a penalty ref! Let's go! We got a penalty with Lucas Ocampos. Beautiful dribbling by the Argentinian. And you know who's taking it. Lucas Ocampos right there. 87. 87. Come on. Let's see if we can do the hat trick. Se viene. Lucas! No! Yes, we can! We got a goal! I'm out! Well, I am a very happy FIFA player right now, not because the Argentinian tank Lucas Ocampos performed excellent on the pitch, but because I did get a 50k profit on this card. I bought him for 130 and I sold him for 185k profit city, baby. But anyway, let's get back to Lucas Ocampos rule breakers card. Fantastic card. Performed when he had to. And I really had a good time with him and Crespo up top in Division 1. Let's go straight into the pros. Number 1 is going to be that 86 pace of his. Really rapid player for a 6'2" player so yeah gg there that is all i have to say he feels pretty fast and you can outrun other defenders on to the second pro is going to be that 88 finishing of his he finishes like the best of them and i put a hawk on him and in that finishing went up to the upper 90s and yeah he finished about 95 percent of the time that is all you need to from your strikers up top onto the passing guys the other pro is going to be that 88 passing of his he definitely can play cam he is a really good cam option and if i did have him on my team i definitely would play him at cam more than striker so you definitely have that option there and then the last pro is going to be that 85 dribbling of his combined with the four star skill moves you, it's just a good time and you are called you are due for a good time with Lucas Ocampos rule breakers card and now on to the cons he does have two cons number one is going to be that three star weak foot obviously I don't have to go into much explanation on that it's just if he was four star four star this guy would be at least 350k double his price to be honest and then the second con is going to be that 75 balance it is a con he does fall down a little bit he feels a little bit clunky just at times but then other times he just feels incredible <laughs> that's all I have to say about that as well let's go on to the leo tips the best position for him is in that midfield center attacking mid position and then the second leo tip is going to be put stay forward getting behind and you'll have a lot of good one-on-one -on -one opportunities with lucas ocampos and that will lead to a final rating of nine out of ten i really like ocampos and if he performed in division one you know he can perform for you as well we play some really good opponents and he managed to score five goals in two games that is all I want for my striker. But anyways, I will conclude to this review. Hopefully it helped you out in deciding whether you want to pick up this card or not. I know a lot of people are going to ask me, Porto or Ocampos? Porto or Ocampos? Honestly, go with Lucas Ocampos, please. He is definitely worth the upgrade. If you can't afford Messi, Ocampo is honestly the second best option in La Liga Santander. And before I let you go, I just want to say thank you so much for your support on Instagram and YouTube lately. You have been killing it with the support. And I love seeing that, guys. Please take a second out of your day. Subscribe to the the channel like this video for more fifa 21 player reviews and that'll be all for today this is leo i bid you goodbye and good night